Hi. I was originally going to talk to you um, right now about a little spiel about editing, but instead of that, I decided to talk about another one of my passions, which is baseball. And the reason that I switched topics is because less than mm, 10 minutes ago, Matt came through the 22nd perfect game in Major League history. Now, I know if you don't follow baseball, I understand that that doesn't mean anything to you, but let me kind of sum up what that means to people who are into baseball. Baseball has been a sport that's been around since the 1800s in America, and professionally it's been organized since the late 1800s. Let's go with 1890. Well, actually, let's go with 1901, because that's the start of the current era. In that amount of time, in 111 years, only 22 times out of all of the games, we're talking about a sport that has 162 games in a season, with at least 15 of those games being played in a day, when those games are being played you break that down over 111 seasons that's a lot of games that's a lot a lot of games think about the number of games that is it's a lot of fucking games in that entire time only 22 times has it happened that somebody's thrown a perfect game now what is a perfect game I have to describe that as well, because I do understand that, you know, you don't understand if you're not from America or you're not a sports fan, you know, but I just want to express to you what this is in the best terms that I can and how huge it is, how big of a deal this, this is. It's, sorry, I'm just, I'm still getting over the amazement of it because it just happened and it's, it's still to witness something like that to witness it it's almost well it's not Haley's Comet it's not that rare but god damn is it rare let's let's put it this way it's rare to a point that I had it on my bucket list to witness it J just to witness it just to watch live this event occur within my lifetime. That That's a pretty rare event. And it, it just happened, and this is the reason I love baseball as a sport. Because every single night, nine players lace up, gear up, put their gloves on, and get ready to go take the field and play ball. That happens 162 times in a regular season. Now, that game that is going to be played that night, chances are, is not going to be the same as any other game ever played. Everybody plays by the same rules, everybody plays the same game. But every single time it's always different. And it's that sort of control and that sort of feeling of utter comfort that just makes you really love something. And that's part of the reason why I love the sport of baseball. Another reason, of course, is because unlike with football, basketball, you have this history this very rich history that most everybody understands at a very elemental level, elementary level. And it, it follows throughout the game. Throughout any game that you're watching, you always hear someone say, Blankety Blank has done Blankety Blank just like Babe Ruth did.
back in 1931. Blah, blah, blah. No, yeah. But it's always there. It's always present. This history is always present. And the reason that it's always present is because every game, nine guys lace up and take the field. And that is why I love baseball. Bye.